we're going to get our show right off the top with a fashion guru. As you know, Mercedes Fashion Week is super duper underway in New York City. And no better person to connect with than Bobby Thomas. You've seen her on the Today Show, and she joins us right now. But first, Bobby, what are the three universal rules of fashion for you? Uh, make sure it fits is my first universal rule. There's nothing worse than something too tight or, you know, sometimes just hiding under something too loose. Um, I think comfortable shoes has been a big lesson for me. <laughs> I have personally fallen off my sky high heels here in New York enough times to know flip flops are a great accessory to stash in your handbag too. <laughs> and, um, I think my universal rule is less is more. I think wearing some great neutrals, investing in some basic pieces, and letting your accessories really shift your look from season to season or day to night, it's you know a really cost-effective way of being chic. Well, one thing's for sure, Bobby, you are chic indeed and looking great today, but let's turn it over to the guys. What advice do you give us guys for looking good? The same thing, accessories, guys. You know, if the belt or is tattered, you know, you need to just buy a new one. It's really inexpensive. And shoes. I see so many men that have shoes that really need an update. You know, whether it's the sneaker that kind of looks like it was from when Bruce Jenner was first famous or, you know, um, dress shoes with jeans. Guys, you're so handsome just you know put a little bit of thought into updating your look we do it you know we'd like to see you do it for us too ouch bobby a nice must say well placed bruce jenner reference now i know you talk all over the world on self-esteem what do you want to share with our viewers today on this issue self-esteem is something women of every age should really um think about first before style because style is self-expression and you have to love yourself and have the confidence to share who you are with the world so you really have to be nicer to yourself stop beating yourself up in the mirror because we start the day looking in one and if you start the day saying Ugh, I hate myself you're already setting out um, you know a domino effect on your day so for me personally I just want women to be a little kinder not only to each other but to yourself. So don't walk up to the mirror on a mission to find a zit or a gray hair or a pimple. You know, start by finding something you like, smile back at yourself, and it'll really set your whole day um, off. And you know, it's not about money either. I think a lot of women are stressed about this, you know, the idea that any of these things might cost too much. DIY, that's why I'm so excited about this snack accessory challenge with Fiber One because it's a really great way to kind of express yourself. This cost me $2 to make and it looks just as fabulous as some of these bracelets that, you know, were maybe $50. But you can really find your own way to sort of add that personal pop in your wardrobe. Well, Bobby, one thing's for sure. We love the pop that you add. Thanks for joining us and enjoy Fashion Week. Thanks so much for having me. Bye, Con.